everybody, and welcome to Sky Jam. Oh my god, hello. Today how... we're playing more Bloodborne. Oh my god, how is everyone doing? I am not doing great. No? Uh, because I... Well, you know... Uh, you know... Uh, I'm trying to think of a name of someone we don't actually know. Give me a moment. Okay. Okay. How about Jordan? Jordan was being such a little bitch. Jordan is always a bitch. Sorry if your name is Jordan. Yeah, not you, Jordan. No, we're, we're talking about Jordan. we're talking about you, bitch. You Jordan. know who you are, Jordan. We're talking about bitch, Jordan. That's right. Yeah. So I was doing my face hair. Uh, yeah. Huh? And are you just in like a library? Yeah. Oh, this is lovely. Right. Can you open that chest, or yeah. will it kill you? Yeah, there's a little thing inside. Oh, good. Yeah, check that out. Anyway, so what about Jordan? Jordan came up to me, and he, he or she, I do not remember, said. Uh, please stop urinating on my car. And I said, no. <laughs> this is an important... This is my me time. I'm sorry, is this a cutscene? Maybe. I actually didn't remember that there was a cutscene here. Ooh, fancy. Interesting. We're up to the next boss battle already. Yeah. <laughs> no. Ooh, those are arranged like a penis. <laughs> Like, ah, uh, aliens! You never know what's gonna come out of your mouth, Skyler. I can tell you one thing that will. <laughs> vomit? Oh no, that's something that. That's one of the few things that actually does. Hmm. Not often. Anyway, so Jordan didn't let you urinate on a car? Yeah. I think we're moved on from that. I'm not. Okay. Oh, you must be very sorry. The incense must have masked your scent. Good. Good. Who is this? Waiting for one of your ilk. Yeah. Waiting for it to end. It always does. Always, always has, you know. I like her like Irish accent. It's so, it's some accent. English, something in that area, something in the Great Britain. Some folks hiding inside. Welsh. Screams of women folk. Women folk. <laughs> oh my God, that's amazing. That's a new. Everybody call girls women folk from now on. Do it. Spelt that way, yeah. Yeah, women folk. One word. Oh, I like this character. Because it totally looks like someone who would just attack you, right? It does, but the incense words of a beast, so I see. So this place is safe from monsters. If you wouldn't mind, I'm sorry, I was not paying attention. I don't know what she see, wants. So if we see anybody who needs somewhere safe to send them here, this is a safe place because the incense keeps the beasts away. Oh, thank you. Uh, so there's another lamp here, that's good. Yeah, wow, that's, that's a quick one. Oh, that was a quick save point, yeah. If only they were all uh, that, uh... So there's a door here. It's closed. Ooh, um, that's correct! So there's, like, a courtyardy place there. We have to go be? straight. Okay, we're in this area now. What's this area? That doesn't seem like you, you liked it here. Um... Ooh. Oh, yeah, there are these guys here. Ooh, he looks like a constable. Missed him. That's fine. That's fine, no. Is he wearing a mask or is that his face? I think it's his face. That's cool. I like the bell he's got around his neck. It's interesting, right? Yeah, he's got a great design. Ooh, this might be my favorite design so far. It's, it's cool, right? Oh, God. He's, oh, he's got a big pointy stick. Yeah, I don't like it. So what happened after Jordan let you pee on a car? I peed on Jordan. Nice. Thanks. End of story. <laughs> the end. <laughs> oh, man. Ooh, it's nice to break out of the Cali Girl. Like, it's fun to do a Cali Girl for maybe like three sentences, and then I'm like, why did I do this to myself? <laughs> Instant regret. <laughs> oh. oh. You got some madman's knowledge. I did. I think that's a card that I made for our intro. It is. Yeah. You all enjoy that intro? Yeah, I hope I, you did. I assume part seven's a good time as I need to ask that. <laughs> yeah. We didn't know it existed back in part one, but we do know now. If for some reason you're watching part seven of Bloodborne and you have not seen part one... Yeah, check go, that out. Go ahead and watch that. Oh, I should have... Oh, uh, heal. Oh, uh, that's one way to heal, I suppose. It is, it is. And you're dead. I like how they're the same enemy, but one of them has a hat, too. He's like... Four points stylisher. <laughs> yeah, style, style points definitely matter. That's, I mean, you should have leveled up your style. 
I, I, you, I, you know what? Uh, regret. I think you made a filled, poor choice. Filled with regret. So much regret. Um, don't totally remember Item. where to go, but I'm just gonna keep progressing in some direction. That's fair. And, that seems uh, like the game. Hopefully that'll work out for me. Is there a switch here? Looks like you can go that way. Am I more. blind? Is there a thing that opens this gate? I might be blind. Uh, I don't see anything. I saw a baby carriage. Okay, maybe... Wait, turn around. Oh, I definitely have to unlock this from another side. Are you sure? I thought there was something in the bush to the left. That is, that is a baby carriage. There's to the left. There are throughout this game. What? To the left. Left of here? Yeah. Was there a switch right there nestled in there? Nah. Okay, I thought that was it. You definitely have to open it from the other side. Okay. So Should we get onto the rooftop? We're gonna have to cool. do some exploring. We can, actually. Lauren, Lauren, Lauren is exploring! Lauren? I think that's from Foster's Home. I think that just came back to me. The Dora the Explorer. Really? Parody they, in Foster's Home. They parodied that? That's, that's pretty Yeah, great. Eduardo watched it. Oh. Wow, that takes me back. I haven't seen that one. That's pretty funny. So, I believe the song she sang in the episode. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was a uh, red, red, red. Things are red. <laughs> that was it. That was the song. <laughs> Things are red. Yeah, it's true. And then it's Eduardo true. sang it in Spanish. It's true. It's definitely true. If you haven't checked out wow. Foster's Home for Imaginary Friends, find it. Watch it. Maybe it's on Netflix. I don't know. I don't Ooh, watch a ton of I hope Netflix. it is. I'll totally watch it. Oh, yeah, dude. I love me some Fosters. This guy's destroying me, apparently. Fosters, I believe, correct me if I'm wrong, was the most award winning show that's ever been on Chart Network. What? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. From the creator of Powerpuff Girls and Wander Over Yonder. So you know it's gotta be good. Huh. Cool. Yeah. The original Powerpuff Girls, not the current reboot. Whoa, that was six blood vials right there. Wow! That's Something big is coming. Something wicked this way comes. Ooh! Yeah, I, so I was gonna say, up. is that actually like a trap? Because that was a lot. I was I was running away because I didn't know Yeah, never to... come back to this area. <laughs> I mean, I have to go through this area, but... Okay, do what you gotta do! There was six blood vials, that's pretty great. Alright. Like... It not being a trap makes it more alarming than if it were a trap. Exactly. Because of the paranoia gets you. Are these, are these, can I call these guys Watchmen? Yeah, I, I think that's a very appropriate name. I'm about to get... Ooh, maybe not. Maybe not. No, I still think it's an appropriate name. Take that, Watchmen. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go down here. I don't remember what's down here. It must be... I wonder what this town looked like when it was not oh, right. all okay. corrupted. Yeah, like, I bet it was a nice place to live. I bet it was very pretty. And you know what? Parts throughout this game are very pretty. Just like... Um, this is a bad example because there's buildings everywhere. But I was like, gonna say, it's gray as fuck, but other than that... No, there are times where you could see, like, the sun. And oh, it kind of wow. looks, like, dim, but it looks so beautiful. I bet. Oh, hey, Popper. Hey, Popper. I vaguely remember it being more colorful than I expected, like, an episode or two ago. Oh, totally. I remember yeah. thinking to myself, whoa, that's pretty nice. Because, like, it always looks like nighttime, right? But yeah. then when you realize it's daytime, it's like, wow, it's like it's like sunset. This is really pretty. I, can, I, I mean, it definitely gives off a good feel, vibe of, like, this is, it's at dusk right now. Yeah, I mean, it's, like, the most depressing a sunset could be. Yeah. But. It's like the sun is setting into a coma. It's right. Exactly, you, you get it. Alright, so there's some more items in the corners here. Let's go to the other one. Let's see what's in the other one. Oh, good thinking. What's in the other corner? Probably not. Hepatitis. Oh, God. Sky, come on. Come uh, on, dude. I'm not the game designer here. Come on. Alright. Hepatitis, that's a little... I don't know. Much? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Everybody in the comments say no hepatitis for me, please. You can specify which type of hepatitis you would not like if you like. I believe there's like <laughs> hepatitis A, hepatitis B. There's a few different types, that's true. Yeah. It's good to specify which yeah. type of hepatitis you want, don't want. Yeah. No, why would you want it, James? Come on. <laughs> yeah, to specify which type you don't want. Alright, so there's a... Uh, this looks like a safe room. This is a building. Um. Oh, look, a switch. That probably does a thing. Hey! hey. What does it do? Just a giant hand comes up and just picks you up. Oh, it's moving that grave. Oh. Ooh. 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 Oh. Hey. <laughs> Hi. Kelly girl again. No. How's it going? Oh. oh, how's it going? Somebody else wants to join you in the grave. 
if you know what Ow. I mean. Oh, Ow. oh, he's got a hey. sickle. Oh, he's hey. farming you. You know, I don't appreciate that. You are that. his crops now. It was a good harvest. Sir, I don't appreciate this ass. All right, what's down here? Yeah, run right for the treasure. Great idea. I mean... Well, it worked. I mean, do you really expect me not to? No, you, you were right. Mubby. Thank you, thank you. Oh, hey, Wolfy Wolf. <gasps> How's it going, puppy? Let's call him Frosticle. Aww, I like the name Frosticle. Frosticle. What flavor is he? See how much easier these guys are now? They're not yeah. easy, but they're easier. Wait, is this the guy up. who stopped you before the first boss? Not the same, no. Okay. Okay, like, maybe he's destroying me. He he killed me. Okay, that was that was probably for calling Wow, they him are easy. a lot easier. That was probably for calling him easy. My bad, everybody. No, that was that's karma right that's, there. That's immediate karma, my that's, favorite kind. That's the prime example of karma right there. Oh no, it's cool guys, you don't have to follow me, it's okay. Oh, hey Popper. <laughs> Oh. Hey, pupper. Oh, that pupper ate the wall there. Please still be following me. Okay, maybe not. I was really hoping he'd really come after me. That'd be amazing. Back to this pupper, who definitely has my blood echoes now. Hey, how's it going? I don't know if we've actually mentioned this, but the purple eyes mean they have. No, you did. Or, okay. I know you did because you said that. Because I know that, and you're the okay. only way I would know that. Okay, cool. That makes sense. Ooh. Yeah, what now? What say you, Popper? He says, Borf, Bark. And dead. Nice. Yes. Oh, you're not gonna give me anything? Oh, you are, you are. He gave you your blood echoes. And this. Bloodstone uh -oh. shard. I forget what those do. What do the bloodstone shards do? Ah! We're gonna find out! Uh, embed? Oh, you can fortify your weapon, make it cooler. Right. Forgot can you, about like, that. give it stripes? Nice. I mean, sure. The answer is yes. Okay. Ooh, you passed away, you could go. I did? Yeah. Let's go exploring. No, oh, you passed it again. Dora the Explorer. Uh, these are just boxes. Nothing hidden in here? Nope. Nope. Just boxes, Sky. Just. Weird that's a weird thing to add in. Fucking Why is it there? Boxes, Skylar. Dude, boxes are really cool. Wasting my goddamn time. I can't believe you're a boxist. I can't believe this bullshit. I'm a boxist. Yeah. You're right. I am. I'm sorry. My bad. Wait. Oh yeah, what's this? This is a little antidote. That's good. Fantastic. That's for when you're feeling under the weather. Like that guy was? Yes. Oh. Just like that guy was. Woo, hey, cool. another lantern. Yay. This is a very productive episode. Are actually. there enemies in this game that look like lanterns until you approach and then rise up from the ground or something? No, but that would be really interesting. Because that... Bloodborne 2, get on that. Okay, okay. okay. Like an anglerfish kind of thing? This is something you can totally relate to. It's not in this game, but it's somewhat related. Okay. You know in Kid Icarus, the treasure chest leg things? Yeah! Those are in Dark Souls, except instead of just growing legs, they're like monsters in the treasure chests. Yeah, I've seen them. Okay, okay, so you know. I love that. I, are they in this also or no? No, I don't, they're, they're I don't only in Dark think Souls. they are. That's actually a classical uh, fantasy monster from the original Dungeons and Dragons. Oh, really? Yeah, that's a mimic. That's like included in every base set of RPG Maker. Well, I'll be darned. It's usually just, like, the treasure chest with teeth and, like, a tongue or maybe an eye inside. Hmm. The Kid Icarus ones do definitely stand out as being, like, an extra level of creepy by just having, like, womanly legs. Yeah. Yeah, I, I, just, I knew you'd be able to relate to that. Yeah, totally. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna go back to where we were. Sometimes they're called a familiar. I just leveled up. I don't know if you knew. Didn't that. even notice. Okay. I fine. did see that we were on the Hunter's Dream, though. Yeah, I leveled up my Blood Tinge. Which does a thing. Cool. What, do we have a new ability now? Can we, like, uh, swing on webs like Spider-Man? No. No. Maybe. Can we make that happen? But our, Is that a goal we can achieve by the end of this playthrough? I, you know, I haven't gotten there. Web slinging? But maybe there's a high enough level. Okay. That we could, uh, Well, Peter Parker is 16, maybe. To. So I'm going to say level 16 is our goal. Yeah. I don't know how old Spider-Man is. That's, that's a pretty good guess. He's definitely a teenager, right? Yeah, I, I figure 16 is good. I, maybe he's like 18. Maybe they wanted to make sure he's like, I don't know, technically an adult. I'm not sure. So that sign says hunters are not wanted here. Cool. 
That's us. Hello. I'm, a, I'm not wanted anywhere. This is what I mean. Like, look at this beautiful yeah, sky. That's pretty beautiful. You there, Hunter. Who's talking to me? Directly. Who's talking to me right now? Turn back at once. Hmm. Is it down the cross? No, no. Oh. So now there's no humans left living in this area. Is that what I'm learning? Um, so there won't be any more hunters out here. Much. Blood, there's six more blood vials. Like, damn. So basically what I got from that is that this area is so secluded from the rest of Yardum that, like, nobody bothers hunting here anymore because the monsters can't even get out. Yeah, but I mean... here we are. We open the door. Basically, all you need to know is that people are claiming it as their territory and we're trespassing. Because we're badass. Didn't seem like they were claiming it. It seemed like they were like, hey, there's no point past this point. I thought they were saying, like, this is our territory, basically. No, they said, hey, there's only monsters out here. Uh, if you come out here, you're... The, and, like, monsters that will not uh, be able to harm those from above, and he well, means back up that stairwell. Well, it said hunters are not welcome here, meaning... That's right. He's, no, it said ha ha hunters are not needed here. And then he thought, they're not welcome here because they're not needed. I'm like, just saying what the sign said. Didn't it say not needed? No, not... Whoa, hello. Whatever, kill things. That sounds good, yeah. Do 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 Bloodborne! We're playing Bloodborne. Not Bloodborne, Bloodborne. Damn it, I ruined the song. God fucking damn it, Skylar. I'm sorry. The <sighs> impromptu song light went on in our studio and I just had to start singing, but I messed it up. You did. You messed it all up. I wonder who controls that light and if we'll ever have a break from impromptu songs here on Sky Jam. Yeah, it's... I mean, he told me not to tell you this, but it's Freddy. It's Freddy? Freddy. Oh my god, Freddy! Yeah. You dingle donker! Our, our good pal Freddy, who's definitely real. Wow, Freddy the real man, that's what they call him. Because that's his full name, Freddy the real man. <laughs> I can't believe you're the one who set up the impromptu music light. Are you Are you listening in right now? Oh, hello. Oh, there you are, he's waving to me through the window that we have in this room. Oh, hey, Freddy. What's up, Freddy the real man? Uh. Also, just figured we mentioned he's a goose. Well, obviously. Uh, y yeah. Wow. What else would, it, would he be? Oh, I guess I might have misled the audience because his last name is The Real Man. That's right. No, Freddy is a goose. Oh, okay. Uh, so if I'm correct, we are soon about to be shot by like a giant cannon, I think. Oh, maybe don't get shot by that guy. I mean, I would like that to not happen. Uh... It's a fair request. That's how I go day to day. You I hope to not, not get, get shot? Yeah, I, I intend to not get shot by a cannon. It's a good life goal, just in general. I wonder how many people have d died from a direct shot with a cannonball. <laughs> like, now I'm really curious. I would like to know that statistic. I'd like to look... I, I'm, I hope it exists. A list of historical figures killed <laughs> by cannonball. <laughs> I would love to know. <laughs> right? Um, like, that's a great way to go. Yeah. Not like, for you, but just for your, like, legacy. Especially if you're, yeah, if you're doing it for someone, like, I have to do this for the good of the troop. Yeah, or if you're, like, there's a pirate battle off the coast and, a, like, a stray cannonball goes flying into the town. <laughs> it's like, oh my god, this guy was buying sausage from me and got shot by a cannonball. <laughs> Oh, the guy who's talking to you is still talking to you. I know. Oh, oh, that's... Oh, okay. It's a machine gun. Is that the guy? It's probably the guy. No, 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 it's not oh, the okay. guy. There's a different guy with a big gun. Maybe you're right. Maybe he is claiming territory. You'd know more than I do. Oh, wait, no, that is the guy. I'm sorry. I thought there was a Damn guy. Damn it, James. You're right. You're right. No, you're right. You're right, man. I should have believed you. I'm that's sorry. Okay. I'm sorry, Sky. You guys. Oh! Oh! Nope. Uh, Not the place I, I want to be. Saw you. I would say so. Wow. Would you guys just? Would you just relax? Would you just take a chill pill? A chili pilly? A chili pilly. That's an adorable name for it. Ah. Okay. Man, I hope. I, I wonder if there's a hard number of people who have been killed by cannonballs. Sorry, I'm still on this, but like. What do you mean by Can't, a hard number? Like, a set, like if there's a known number of death by cannonballs. Oh, yeah. Because it can't still be happening. Like, I don't know anywhere that... It's arguable. 
where are cannonballs still in use? Uh, well, maybe there are civil war reenactments where people take it way, way too seriously. Enough to murder each other with cannons? Yeah. Oh, man. New goal in life. Witness a civil war reenactment where people take <laughs> it so people seriously. Die. They kill each other with cannons. Wow. Actually, you know, I don't even care about people dying. I mean, I care about people dying. I don't want people to die. Whoa, hey. It's Bedsheet Guy. Bedsheet oh, Guy. Oh, you were up a little late at that party. Am I right, buddy? Hoo-hoo. Ha-ha. You and your bedsheet on your head. I just want to see a reenactment where they use cannons, because that sounds like fun. Right. Mm. Oh. Like they set up the enemy troops like bowling pins. <laughs> no. Do not want to be grabbed by that guy. Yeah, he's a hugger. He's he's a very aggressive hugger. Ooh. Like he really Just means like it. old Peepaw. He really he really means it. Peepaw Sky Jam. <laughs> he means it when he hugs you. Yep. Um alright. I don't know if I'm getting closer to this guy or not. By the way, the guy shooting us is another hunter. Yeah, I kinda of picked up on oh, that. Oh okay. Sorry for questioning you before. I'm gonna not be here. I'm not gonna I'm gonna not be here. If that's if that's good with everyone, I'm just gonna not be here. I know somebody who'll be happy to hear that. Me? Uh no, the guy who's trying to shoot you so you leave. Good point, good point. Okay, ow. Okay, ow. Oh, ow. Wow! Wow, okay. Uh next time on Sky Jam. We'll dream and give some thought. A nice wig we resembles a ponytail. <laughs> the cane hearse. <laughs> Examples of decadent art. Oh, it's gone. Be used as one sees fit. Okay, bye, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we're so good at outros. Oh, man.